Hey guys, what's going on? Prangle Gaming here, and today I'm going to be giving you a vlog. Well, technically it's a vlog, but it's just me going to be talking about the World Cup groups day by day. There's eight days to the World Cup when I'm recording this right now. So the first thing I'm going to do today is talk about Group A of the World Cup, which is Brazil, Croatia, Mexico and Cameroon. Now these all have pretty decent players in it. Brazil being the host of the World Cup itself, so they have players like Neymar, Fred, Julio Cesar, David Luiz, Thiago Silva. Their squad's well known compared to everyone else. However, they are not doing amazing. Let me just point that out because Spain won the last World Cup in South Africa. And, well, they're not doing the best. However, we do have a few underdogs in this group. Croatia will have the likes of Luka Modric, uh, Olic, uh, the beast Mario Mandzukic from Bayern Munich. That's a pretty decent player. I know some people actually believe he's one of the best strikers in the Bundesliga. He might be, but I don't know. Mexico, they have the likes of Avia Hernandez, uh, Perrotta. Them lot. Like, I'm just going through the team now. Moreno, who plays for Espanyol last time I knew. Apart from that, I don't really know anyone from there. And Cameroon, they've got a few well-known faces, especially the likes of the absolute speed demon on FIFA, Samuel Eto, along with Song, who plays for Barcelona, a very good midfielder. On Kalu, I have in my Galatasaray team, he's quite a good centre-back. Bedimo, Shiru, they're the type of players I don't know. Group A is quite a nice group. Now, let me just say with my predictions, I think that group winners could be either Croatia or Brazil. Now, the reason I'm not saying this is because Brazil have struggled at times in the past to do well. I know they're hosting it, but it doesn't mean necessarily they're going to win every match and they're going to dominate teams. They might do, but at the moment, I've, I am much like Croatia. So I'm going to say winners to be Croatia in the group. Second, Brazil. Third, Mexico. Fourth, Cameroon. But Cameroon could be surprises for some of us because they've got a decent team. And they've got a few players that maybe we haven't looked at before. And they could shock the world of football. So the place that's happening in Rio is going to be fantastic events there for us all to watch. But I do believe, that, like, looking over the world rankings, Brazil are 4th, Croatia are 20th, Mexico are 19th, and Cameroon are 50th. Now, going into a bit about Cameroon... African teams haven't really succeeded at the World Cup. No team from Africa has ever won a World Cup. I think the furthest the team's gone is either the quarterfinals or semi-finals. I know that Ghana did it and got knocked out against Uruguay at the 2010 World Cup. So, I was a bit disappointed there because I actually enjoyed watching Ghana play as Mojian was a very good player. I watched him when he was at Sunderland. I felt for Ghana because they didn't deserve to get knocked out. Suarez cheated, and well, enough, nothing can happen there. So, however, I think that if Brazil do go through, they could win the league. I think Croatia are a better team, just because I want a European team to do better. But... Brazil have the better players, the better skills. They have Neymar, of course. He's on their home grounds. So, I think if Brazil get past the group stages and probably win the group, then they're going to go up against Spain or Holland, probably. Or maybe even Chile, because Chile are doing well. So, yeah, they'll play Spain or Holland. And to be fair, that is... Well, it's not the most ideal thing if you've just gone for a group to be playing some really, really strong teams like Spain and Holland. But if Brazil go through, I think they are definitely beat them. And the chance of them winning the World Cup from there will be probably quite easy. A lot easier compared to playing Spain and Holland. Anyway, guys, that'll be all for today. 
I hope you have enjoyed this Group A of the World Cup in Brazil, like speech, vlog, whatever you want to call it. So, yeah, that's all for today. Like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video.